cousins. Even Marty, the degenerate, who's an alcoholic by 12. Uncle Donald, he hands me this shiny wee box. He's going on and on. Open it, boy, open it. You'll love the surprise. Thing is, I already know that it's a major Howl action figure. I was a nosy bastard. So, I open it up. I look right at my uncle and act surprised. He sees right through me. <laughs> right? Out of nowhere, Uncle Donny grabs Major Howells and he kicks him out the goddamn door! Oh, shit! Room goes dead quiet. Uncle Donny just trucks. He's got to surprise the boy on his birthday. <laughs> Was there a point to your story? Surprises. They fill me with dread and anxiety. Getting Booby out there, team. Might want to buckle in. What the hell? Scratch that. Strap your shoots on. I ain't stopping on the island, but this storm might have a off to a promising start, eh? Anyone read me? That's not too promising. Uh, get a beacon signal, though. Could be the others. They'll get to the counter. Hope they're out there. This place is bringing up some bad memories. We need to get out of here. Hope the others made it. Anybody there? Lieutenant Caliso, reporting for duty, sir. Glad you made it, soldier. You good? Huh. Bit banged up, but I'll survive. 
Any sign of the outsider? Negative. Kid! You out there? <laughs> Reunited at last! You made it. Well, thanks to you, Cog. Goddamn maniac kicking me out of a burning plane. Well, outsider, seems like I should get a thank you, seeing as you're alive. You're assuming I want to be alive. <clears throat> Teams back together. Now what? You all follow the beacon, right? Let's find a way up to it. This looks like a good way out. Come on. know we survived. Only way to do that, locate the crash site. Hope that radio is intact. I saw the condor go down. There's quite a trail of smoke. Follow the smoke. Great. Now what? Uh, now this looks like a way through, but, uh, hmm. Problem, sir? The back isn't what it used to be. Especially after that crash. Leave it to me, sir. Just need a moment. That dead tree's caught on some vines. Heads up! Well done, soldier. Come on, let's go. Bit of a ways down, huh? You got a problem with heights? <laughs> After what we've been through, can you blame me? Looks like the way through here. So, either you know our destination before we left? They didn't tell me shit. All I know is there was ocean beneath us a long time. What the hell was that? Another reason to find that radio ASAP. God damn. What was this thing? It's huge. But whatever killed it was bigger. Well, that is one fucked up plan. There's no way that radio is operational. We need to eliminate it as an option before we move on to another plan. Come on! Grandmother left the Galangid Islands when she was young. But photos from this place. Hell of a way to reconnect with your roots.
Must have flown off the plane. <laughs> Thank goodness. Now we're talking. My dad always told me I was lucky. Lucky as a locust in long pants, he'd say. So that's why you were picked for the mission. Stack up. You never be too prepared for what's coming. Come get your ammo. more by the minute. You were saying something about luck, boy? Hey, we're safe, right? Look, some more supplies. I told you, lucky. What the fuck? What the lock? Huh, I stand corrected. How the hell did the swarm get to an island? Sign of the times, old man. The entire world is infected with them. Keep pushing through. Try to get out of this swamp. Tougher than the locusts. Well, old man, I for one like our odds. Won't be long before the flock's back. Let's go. <clears throat> Look at all that. Now we stand a fighting chance. Do you even know how to use half this ordnance? You're due, Grandpa. My dad taught me to shoot. Ah, you didn't like me. You're quite similar. So Shit! Look! You've got to be kidding me!
What's next, sir? Stick to the plan. Find the wreckage. Find the radio. Gotta be a way through here somewhere. God damn it, block. Have you seen them before? I We need to look around. There'll be another way to get to that condo. Nate, good to go! There's a way through here. Someone give me a hand. <coughs> that smell again. You ran into it too? <coughs> I gotta get out of here. The gas? Oh, the smoke. <coughs> Out of the frying pan. This looks like the tail end. With any luck, cockpit and radio is up ahead. Hey, lucky. Remember? Quite a literal interpretation. Cockpit's on the other side of the door. Let's go. Ah, oh, damn it. Guess the radio's not here. The entire cockpit ain't here, Gramps. So what's the plan if we find that precious radio smashed to pieces? There's a good chance that whoever organized this operation is well aware of what's happened. Might take a while. They'll send someone. But if they died in a crash as well... How are your survival skills? Terrible. Delivery driver, remember?
Good work. Now let's find that radio. This thing is absolutely destroyed. Nice spot to build a shelter, though. As we settle down into our new lives here on Hell Island. I'm sick. isn't the only one we signal. Doobie's incoming! Looks like we're gonna have to earn that right move. Here they come! <laughs> Don't let them flank us! that hurt us. That's it. Oh, <laughs> 
Here's the results. Right. Sorry to be late and all. We survived a horrific condor crash, fought an endless horde of monsters from hell, and barely escaped with our lives. But uh, how's your day been? Well, it's about goddamn time. Holy shit. What? Show some respect. It's Colonel Victor Hoffman. It's an honor, sir. A real hell of an honor. Shared sentiment, soldier. That's why you're here. Best of the best. This here's Hannah Cole. She's my number one on this covert operation. She knows a lot about science things and uh, is, uh, well, in, in general, quite pleasant to be around. Advanced degrees in biochemistry, toxicology, chemistry, and science things. Thanks, Hoff. Anyway, good to finally meet you. What kind of operation is this? Hannah? Now, what we're looking at is a schematic of the Pahanu Cog Bunker, designation Sanctum. It never served its true purpose, instead becoming a burial site at the end of the Locust War. And now, well, it's a full-blown swarm hive. I need you to infiltrate and plant a chemical bomb at its heart so we can kill them from the inside out. It's a high-risk mission, but if we get this right, we can wipe out those bastards and use what we've learned to save the entire goddamn planet. Now, I've made promises to the COG, and through my people on the mainland, I've made promises to you. Complete the objective, and I will deliver. Questions? Whatever the mission, sir, we're in. What? He's the hell out of retirement. <laughs> Well then, what are we waiting for? All right, team. You'll be infiltrating the base from its main entrance. All of our recon efforts indicate it remains fully powered by the thermal reactors. Once inside, you'll need to access the bottom floor. It's 20 levels down, but the elevator system will ease the burden. What kind of recon operation did you run? We sent a few teams of DBs, but lost contact. The truth is, we needed somebody with access. Keegan, you're up. I'm on. Commissioning sequence initiated by Special Operations Officer Corporal Jeremiah Keegan. Welcome to Sanctum. Wait. I outrank you? Yeah, long story. All right, guys, now that we have access to Sanctum, I'm officially initiating our operation. Control has assigned your team designation as Scorpio. Copy that, Hannah. Scorpio moving in. All arrivals must report in with our Sanctum security officers. Please proceed to the waiting area in an orderly fashion. Security officers. Gotta make sure the right people get in. What exactly does the right people mean? Sanctum was meant to protect the most important COG citizens. Scholars, politicians, celebrities. And which category did you fit in, Gramps? None of the above. Just a goon working for important people. about the regular folk? Just leave them out to be locust chow? It was purely a numbers game. I'll have the resources to save everyone. <laughs> Except the rich, famous, and connected, of course.
decontamination. There should be a final security checkpoint on the other side. All citizens of Sanctum are required to undergo decontamination protocol before entering the facility. Please step into a chamber to begin. Initiating decontamination. You'd think with how bad the cog was losing the war, they'd be willing to take in any poor soul that survived. Still need to follow protocol. Protocol, my ass. <laughs> Decontamination complete. Proceed to the briefing room for further instruction. This is my kind of sanctuary. It's engineered, has uh, systems. There's an order to it. Real confidence. This is where new arrivals would have been processed. After proper clearance, of course. That should do it. Activating Sanctum Core Systems. Stand by. So, what happened to you? The volcano powering the thermal generators? <laughs> Ended up being too unstable. The whole place was deemed uninhabitable. All systems so, after online. the war, they Internet turned it into state. a locust burial site. Warning. Biological threat detected. What the hell? Something's trying to get through. Defensive positions! Retack! Looks like we found your robot, Tana. Tana covered in swarm shit! Damn it! We sent DB's into the ventilation system, man. Never heard that. Damn it, man. Clear! Swarm infected DBs. There's no end to the cog's shite to clean up. Welcome to my life, kid. Without great soldiers fighting back, the 
Did you send on recon duty? A few? A lot, actually. Sorry. I know the DBs are making your job difficult, but it proves that we need experienced human soldiers to deal with the swarm. It's what Hoffman's been saying since the threat first emerged. Glad to hear that the Colonel and I are of similar minds. Yes, me? First Minister Jin's always been a bit too eager to use robots to solve her problems. My opinion? Find a plot of land far from all cog civilization. You'd be surprised how much better life can be without their constant meddling. So what the hell are you doing working for? Well, Keegan, I'm a complex man. <laughs> if the world came to an end, this wouldn't be a bad place to hang out. This panel must be connected to that door. Let's get it open. Let me take a look there, Grumps. Ah, someone installed the fuse wrong way round. Ha! Got it! from the volcano. Oh, is it, is it just the volcano? That's another brilliant cog idea, isn't it? Throw the last of humanity into a fucking volcano. Anyway, the elevators are on the far side of the main hub. What's back here? Let's find out. Hey, Matt, think you can take a look at this? Oh, sir. Yes, sir. Oh, well, this doesn't look too complicated. Got it! Right, got some rejects. So, what was our mission protocol? Initiate heavy gardening?
Hannah, we've got an infestation coming up into the hub from below. Damn. The hive is growing faster than we predicted. like the infestation has affected the elevators. Oh, is this wee gas bomb going to do the job? Yes. Yes, of course. As long as you deliver the bomb to the center of the hive, it should work. Should work? Enough. Let's get down there. Wonderful. Huh? <laughs> 
need to get to the thermal control room. Should be another access console somewhere. Console looks offline, but I'll give it a try. No good. Have you tried turning it off and on again? Can we please take this seriously? I'll take a look. So I was thinking, why don't we just drop the bomb down the shaft? Looks like it goes all the way to the bottom. Absolutely not. You heard, Hannah. We deploy the payload to the center of the hive. That's the mission. Granted. Opening the engine Didn't we want thermal control? Huh. That's odd. Here they come. Watch it! Stop it! I've got ammo! Time to think. Let's go. Snipers! Oh, you're kidding me! God damn, it's not in here. We are in a volcano. Oh, and the actual jets of fire would do it. Come on! There's gotta be a way through. One of us needs to flank their position, or the others draw fire. so you can come through. Ventilation closed in subsection 28C. Potential heating hazard detected. Venting subsection 28C. What's that mean? Juby! Sanctum, you've got your priorities all wrong! Grenadier! Fight's not over! Incoming Frank! This whole place is working against us. Cut that talk out and stay focused. 
You cog always got a problem with facing the truth, eh? Resupply depleted. Warning. Ventilation station temperature exceeds safe operating protocols. Cooling area. Ventilation station now within safe operating temperature. Proceed. Shit! Last gun! It's protecting the Scion! If the swarm doesn't kill us, the climate control will! Fuck it up, kid! Take her advice.
a goddamn army. I am sick of your complaint. There's a door ahead, and we're going through it. Thank <laughs> you. 
made it out of that one, and it's only going to get worse. We all know it. We are going to die down here. For what? You're afraid of dying? You should have thought of that before you took this on. Oh, believe me, I'm ready to die. But I want it to count. You got some sort of death wish. Not a death wish. But when the dust settles, I want to have made a goddamn difference. If that's what it takes. We all took this mission to make a difference. And we have our orders, outsider. Now, let's make it count. Look, old man. All I know is I want our sacrifice to matter. Take a look around. We have to face the facts. The way things are going, this will all be for nothing. So, Lonnie, we almost there. Not even close. Uh, we made it this far. We'll find another way down. <laughs> Goddamn cog. Just can't admit defeat, can you? I'm done taking shit from you, boy. <laughs> to hell with the objective. The hell you doing? Making it count. Brother. Move! Deadly toxin detected. All personnel must vacate safe Don't stop! It'll kill us too! Keep moving!
you saw with your own eyes, the gas didn't work. Would you two shut the hell up? Tech, copy? We're in trouble. We ride the giant door down a lava river to be completely accurate. I read you. And what? Fast as you can make it. We're moving south from the main entrance. Okay, on my way.
Austin! A grenade. Nice! We're clear! All Max save the day again! Please hold your applause! We're still riding a goddamn tour down a river of lava, thanks to you. Correction! Riding a goddamn tour down a river of lava alive, thanks to me! Do it! We got a scion! Come on, come on! She 
We'll switch it off. We're ready. And we are out of here. <laughs> now that's lucky. Oh, everything's a joke to you. Getting by on the skinny and feet, relying on your luck. You don't have a clue about working with others. Listen, old man, I don't give a shit. Enough! Carry on up ahead! <sighs> was a failure. Not if we uncovered new data. Anything? The drones, Juvies, roasted them. Heavier swarm. We didn't have the punch we needed. You got anything stronger? Mm. Something that can sink the entire island, maybe. But how about a few canisters of that nightmare acid that killed all them bastards on the beach, eh? Damn. You might be onto something. I was joking. Even if that could work, there's a problem. We don't know what's responsible for the attack or where to find it. Why, Leahy. My grand used to tell me stories about her people. How the young men and women would travel the ocean to face a god. It was their rite of passage. If anyone knows something about what we saw on the beach, it's my grandmother's people. Well, go then. Make contact. See what you can learn. Anna. You prep for field work. I want you there to ask the right questions. I'm on it. Let's go, Scorpio. And Hannah? If we obtain some of that nightmare acid from whatever attacked the swarm on Pahanu, we can combine it with the toxin I was sent from New Hope. Hopefully someone here can fill us in on what exactly that acid is and how to get it. We still have to find a better way to the heart of the hive. Yep. I'm working on a solution for that too. Is there another ab Through this door, Scorpio. Give me a hand. Huh. Peaceful. Never thought I'd see where my family came from. Even with all the stories and memories she shared. Brad never told me why she left. Any of your family still live here? Distant relatives, I'm sure. Guess I should introduce myself. Feels like an odd way to reconnect, you know? Marching in, middle of the night. Oh, I'm sure we'll be given a warm welcome. Not every day a band of armed soldiers wanders into town. Well, hopefully they'll be understanding given our rather dire circumstances. Music? Sounds like quite a party. Everyone must be gathered in that hole over there. Couldn't think of a better way to make our entrance. 
Come on, then. I wonder what they use this space for. Hmm. A workshop? These islands are known for their carvings. Bridge is knocked out. Need another way in. Just trying to find the quickest way to the hall. So, Hannah, been meaning to ask. You any relation to the coal trade? Right. Because every coal is related to Augustus. Sorry. Was just curious, is all. <laughs> Getting a sense you hear that question more than you'd like to. No, it's okay. I like my dad. I mean, yes. He's my dad. Just please, please don't ask me about Thrashball. I find it tedious. Augustus Cole. You know I saw him play, but that ain't what I remember him for. Man to legend. A true definition of the cog frontline hero. Yeah, you aren't wrong, Keegan. That's what everyone sees in my father. I wanted to be just like him. A lot of people find it hard to believe, but at home, the coal train. Quiet man. Awkward. His introspection about the war took me far from the military. He wanted more from me. That's what I fought for, baby. Dad said, one serum with an education could do more to turn the tide of war than a single grunt with a gun ever could. You mentioned your degrees back when we first met. That's uh, that's a lot to know for a kid. <laughs> yeah. Mom was always buying me books. Books for my birthday, books for special holidays. I had books out my ass. Interesting. Oh, I loved it. I think it was a distraction to keep me away from what my dad was interested in. What? Sports. And I still don't want to talk about thrash ball. How'd you meet Hoffman? Through dad. Hoffman had the idea for this special project after what happened with New Hope. He got his hands on the New Hope toxin, but he needed a specialist to do anything with it. And so, here I am, working on a plan to save the world. You know, 
know, Hoff has been working on this plan for a long time. But when I first got here, he mostly rolled around in his wheelchair yelling out the window. He really hates the First Minister. Hope there's someone in here willing to help. Well, that all depends on how long their party's been going on. Well, I hate parties. A little help here. <clears throat> oh no! Everyone's gone. Looks like this ain't a diplomatic mission anymore. Can someone turn off that damn radio? Hey, Lonnie. Take a look at this. All this imagery around a creature of some kind. Can you read the language? It's been a long time since Gran taught me why Lehan. But I can try. The scroll references the awakening. It's the rite of passage she talked about. Listen. The mantle. A terror stalks and desires to consume. Let it be your burden. Let it not feed. The journey. Our ancestors carry you across the world. Their spirits guide and watch over you. Spirit walk. Enter the Fade and journey amongst the ancestors. The path of our people will reveal your burden. The fear. Awaken. Reborn. Renewed, not consumed. Your heavy burden, transformed. Light as the feather. Face the creature. Ha! Huh. Looks like a big fucking bird. A bird? Feathers. Huh? Gran would tell me stories about the Wakatu. A flying demon that all children must face as a rite of passage. Are you suggesting that thing at the beach? Yes, the Wakatu isn't mythology. It's real. That's it. We track this Wakatu down and get a sample of its poison. Hey, after we figure out what's going on here. We'll find the villagers. Come on, Scorpio.
Let's head into the village. This way. Damn, snipers! Shit. Where the hell did those bastards get here? How are we gonna handle this? We killed the swarm. Every last one of them. Wrong with scoping out the area and stabbing the bastards in the neck. Fair point. Fly 
supply depleted. No sign of the villagers. Where'd they go? They have more use for us alive. Those are the pods here, though. They take them somewhere. A defensible structure. The temple up on the ridge. We can still save them. Let's go. Ready to resupply. You doing okay, Hannah? Oh, yeah, yeah. I'm good. We've got your back. That's right. Thanks, guys.
Let's hope we're not too late. Let's go. There are stories of people who survived being snatched and potted. But we need to be prepared for the reality that those chances are often slim. I'm not giving up on them. Let's get to the temple. Locusts couldn't grow between the islands. That's why Sanctum was built on Bohanan. How did they get to Walehi? Okay, but we can still help. Come on. Look, in the tree. We collected feathers from the Wakatu and brought them here. No pods, though. No bodies.
The toxin coming from the feathers. It seems to have some kind of psychological effect. Makes you hear stuff, right? Stuff you'd rather not think about. Yeah. Yeah. But this incense, it's negating the toxic effects. We saw the same incense in the ritual room, back on Pahanu when we first landed. This proves that we can find the Wakatu. But right now, we need to find the villagers. Secure the village. Then we can go hunting for that Wakatu of yours. Ammo's ready. Even one day too late. One day makes all the difference. They're gone. We couldn't save them. So, what the hell are we going to do about it? Make the fuckers pay! Now we're on the same page, sister. you guys down. 
You're doing great. A real natural. Wish your dad could see you. The coal train is going to be rolling over Hoffman at full speed if he hears about this little alley. Put that wee death machine to good use, eh, Scorpio? We can't move it without power. Mac, this is all you. On it, Keegan. Gonna be a goddamn messy slot. Hey, give up! The... We're here to finish the goddamn water yet. Give him hell, Scorpio.
every inch of ground we take back. Definitely feeling the need for a win. Saved a few of them, but even one. Acquisition. <laughs> Just a little more. Let's go, Scorpio. fate on their entire species. I still don't understand how they got here from Pahanu. Looks like we found an answer, Hannah. The lava tubes. This is how they got here. Lava tubes? Then maybe they're connecting the islands. Hannah, above you! I can't handle. We're on the road. 
them, changed them. They wanted to change me too, Keegan. It's okay. We're safe now. We've got to signal tech. Let them know where we are. <laughs> Scorpio, I'm seeing a flare on Bahanu. How the hell did you get off of Wailehi? Long story. Anna's hurt. We need a stretcher. Copy that. Hang tight. On my way. Where are we? All the way back on Pahanu. The heart of the hive. Oh, wow. Survive being snatched. <laughs> yeah. The stories are true, huh? Still there, Scorpio? Stretcher incoming. <sighs> so 
Sorry I got caught. Mess us all up. She's on, Tech. Take her up. Hey, you made it. Then. That's all that matters. It'll take me a bit to secure the stretcher. You guys good for a few? We'll manage. Thank goodness. Honestly, I can't believe she survived. But she did survive. What's on your mind? The Snatcher was taking Hana to the heart of the Hive. And we need a more efficient way to get there. Oh, no. You're not suggesting we let them capture us. Hold that thought! Swarm's here! Raid the Snatcher? You're serious. We get snatched up. Snatched up and smuggled right into the hive. Then what? There's no guarantee we can survive that. Fair point. But I feel like Hannah and her action science might have an answer for that. Hell. It might work. Get smuggled into the heart of the hive. But we still gotta get out of here first! More swarm on the ridge!
Gatu made quick work of the swarm. I feel good about Hana's toxin plan. If we can manage to catch that thing. I'm not sure we can do it alone. Agreed. Now's the time to ask Hoffman to bring in some reinforcements. <sighs> Keegan, this is not a call. What? What the hell are you talking about? Hoffman's gone rogue. It's just us. Colonel Hoffman is a decorated COG veteran. Aye, but just think for a second. The access codes to sight. If Hoffman's working with the COG, why couldn't he just get those codes himself? That's... Oh, that's ridiculous. Lani, you don't believe this, do you? Doesn't make sense. Why would he lie to us? You think I'd join an actual COG mission? That man is used to doing whatever it takes to get the job done. Oh, shit! This way! And another thing! If this was a legit operation, why would everything be so goddamn secret? When we got here, we had no clue where we were going. Nick, not the time! Knew we couldn't shake it for long. First Minister rejected my plan to deal with the Swarm. She said her damn robots could handle them. So I used my forced retirement to uh, launch a mission of my own. All this time, we were on a goddamn rogue operation? That's right. Look, I know your past. That you've all suffered and struggled, but you've still got that fight in you. Purpose. That's why we're here. It was our lives on the line. The fate of the entire planet is on the line, soldier. I'm not here to save the world. The swarm took my son. Dragged him. Screaming into the dark. I failed to protect him. To fight for him. I joined up to make these fuckers pay. And I planned to die doing it. But here we are. So, to hell with it. I'll live. And I'll fight for what family I have left. I won't stand by and watch more people suffer. Not when I can do something about it. We know how to get to the heart of the hive. All I need is one sample. And you'll get it. But I won't let my brother face this one alone. Wish I could have been there for you, Mac. And your son. But I'm here now. Well, that's it then. Once more into the screaming dark. Scorpio, this is it. Find the Wakatu. Extract 
Back to where it's all begun. Like my ancestors have done for generations. Enter the Fade and walk amongst the ancestors. The path of our people will reveal your burden. There's our path. I'll be done. Mythology. Just stories. I was in prison on Grand Pass. Wish you could see me now. It's none of my business, but... It's okay. Where's what now? You both should know. I fucked up. Deliberately ignored an order. Thought I knew better than everyone else, and someone got killed. Monsieur. Good man. The truth is, as much as I want to go back, I don't know if there's a spot waiting for me. I know that feeling. Sometimes there ain't no going back. And I'm learning that might be okay. <clears throat> Lonnie, what's this? Some kind of effigy. My father used to carve pieces like in from wood. Said they would protect us from dark spirits. in the action. Having a team at my side. I've missed this feeling of being part of something bigger. I know that feeling too. This way. Give me a hand. <clears throat> Your old job. Still, uh... Classified? No, I can spill. I was part of the Brash Brigade. Locust cleanup crew. Cleanup crew? Some of the locusts survived the war. We made them disappear. Quietly. So, 
emulsion countermeasure at Azura. As far as the public knows, the war ended there. There was still more work to be done. There should be another way around. Through the ruins. Stationed on Azura, doing basically guard duty. Onyx exiles, they call us. No glory, no rank, and no purpose. For all those years. I'm sorry, Keegan. I don't know all this rank stuff, but what you're doing here may smart at each other. Thanks. I uh, appreciate it, Mac.
rot is dead. Fantastic! Take Here it! Here I come! Back up, man! Did you say children used to walk this path? Well, there weren't any swarm back then. Right, right. Keep going. Help me out. That tree there. He was on the carving in the village hall. He must be the Wakatu's nest. Then we're still on the right path. You know, before all this, I really thought my life was over. That I'd live out the rest of my days in prison. So you joined up when Hoffman's crony found you, hmm? Exactly. Same here. What else can you do when you've lost everything?
to the tree. some debris here. That's a whole damn vulture. A vulture went down on Pahanu? You found 144B. It went down shortly before I arrived on Galangi. It was loaded with the initial DB4s to lead our charge into the bunker. Think we could recruit them to our cause? Worth a shot? Surrender to the cog! They ain't friendly! Why the hell are they attacking us? Not a cog mission, remember? Ah. They must be following their default directives for Capcom property. Nothing we can't handle! Trackers incoming! That's oh, another! Raise the flag and lead it! inside. Not a problem. This will get the door open. Got it! More DBs! Great! Even more unfriendly traitorous cogbots! Target locked! Shields. 
Clear. They're probably gonna run into more DBs from that vulture. Stupid bot. Tell me about it. But but I wouldn't have given for their help when the swarm attacked my village. What happened? A slaughter. Then the terrifying quiet. Even if I wasn't miles from home, I couldn't have stopped it. I wasn't a fighter. You did what you could, Mac, and you lived. If I was such a coward, I would have died with him. Coward? Show me a man sacrificing more than one who's lost their child. I'd follow you into any fight. Uh, thank you. Both of you. Drop on standby. Sounds like one hell of a fight going on down there. Should we take a look? All of them. How do we get to the Wakatu tree from here? This river goes right to the tree. We just need a boat. There must be one around here. Here. You think this is it, Lonnie? Yes, this is it.
One hell of a journey, that's for sure. I only got this far thanks to your support. I uh, gotta admit, I was wrong about you, Mac. We both were. Well, I had my assumptions about you two as well. Look at us now! Team Scorpio, saving the planet! <laughs> <laughs> Keep them off the board! Puffer's on the right! Scared them off. <laughs> Even the swarm must recognize the god of Bahanu. You know, my grand's final words to me were about struggle. Am I suffering to find the true light? The weak or the strong? I wanted to know which I'd be. She said, live and discover for yourself. Excellent. I think I would have liked it. Doesn't matter how hard we tried to run from our past, everything we did led us here. Led us to this island, a thousand miles from the war. This time I'm gonna make a goddamn difference. I thought this was my chance to prove myself. 
for the Brash Brigade. For the memory of my CEO. My brand is right. The path of my life will determine who I become. They brought me home. Here. They gave me a new family. That goes for all of us. You survived a hell of a lot to find home, Scorpio. I say we fight like hell to save you. Looks like this is it. Fear. The Wakatu wants to swarm off this island as much as we do. We should try to get the sample without killing it. Agreed. Be good to see the natural order restored.
awaken, reborn, renewed, not consumed. Your heavy burden, transform. Light as the feather. Put up one hell of a fight. You, uh, think it'll live? Yeah, I do. It's a good day. Everyone survives. you to know. It's your fault, and I'm gonna fucking haunt you. How's your nerves, Major Howe? Oh, to hell with my anxiety. This time, I'm the surprise. See you on the other side. 